this is Cameron Chai bringing you another episode of Azo TV and today I'm speaking to Rob Morris from Ocean Optics and he's going to give us a little demonstration of their STS mini spectrometers. What we're demonstrating is our newest smallest spectrometer ever, the STS micro spectrometer which is a CMOS based detector spectrometer with applications in the UV vis all the way from 350 nanometers out to 1100 nanometers. This is conceived as a high volume OEM type product because the size of it, the small footprint, lends itself very well to embedding into other analytical devices. The other thing about it is it has a fixed fiber design which helps to ensure reproducibility from unit to unit and lot to lot. That's something that's very important for high volume manufacturers. Our demonstration today, we're showing the STS spectrometer, six of them actually, all hooked up to fiber optics that are looking at this light source here. So as the light changes color, we look on the screen, you can see each of the channels is represented here showing the absorbance, the color essentially, in real time as the light changes. This is one of the components of the STS that is very important for both the high volume user as well as individuals who have an application or two that they would like to use. An interesting thing about the STS is that it's based on this CMOS, CMOS detector technology, which has actually been around for quite a while. The technology is advanced to the point where we can actually, with uh, the technology of the detector, as well as some changes to the optical bench we've made, have performance spectroscopically comparable to larger systems. That's a very important breakthrough from previous efforts to do the same sort of thing. And so, so the STS seems to have a very high response rate. It does. So it's very it's much more sensitive than in earlier iterations. And in fact, it actually on the uh, optical resolution side and the signal to noise and dynamic range of the system performs in some cases better than our core spectrometer line, which has been around for 20 years now. So this is quite an advance. Uh, and if you have, there's more information available on the SDS on our website at oceanoptics.com. All right, Rob, thanks very much for telling us about the STS micro spectrometers. And like you said, if anybody wants more information, they can find that on your website. Thank you.